It's really nice here, isn't it? Mm -hmm. It's really pretty. It's gorgeous. We should come back tomorrow and have us a little picnic. Oh, yeah, that sounds fun. Sounds like a plan. I'm gonna go explore a little bit. Okay, well be careful, okay? I will. I'm kinda tired, I think I'm gonna sit for just a second. What's that doing here? What is that? flower. It doesn't even look real. What's it doing right here? <laughs> it feels so weird. I just don't understand the smell of that flower. And ever since then, I've just had this weird and strong and strange desire to just tell the truth. Starving. So, what's for dinner? Vegetable lasagna that I always make? Ew! Mom, look, to be honest, I really, really, really cannot stand your vegetable lasagna. What? You don't like my vegetable lasagna? The truth is, I only said I liked it just so I wouldn't hurt your feelings. Sorry! I got a little secret I need to talk to you about. No. Come on. No, please, Seriously, don't no be secrets. Silly. I have a surprise for your mommy. I want to take her on a trip somewhere and I need your help with it. So do me a favor. Think about it. You come up with some ideas. Let me know, okay? Okay. Okay. I'll see you later. Hey, Dad? Yes, ma'am? While we're at it, I just figured I would tell you, to be honest, I don't really like your hair like that. I just kind of wish you would style it different. What's wrong with my hair? Kind of hurt my feelings, babe. Sorry. What am I gonna do? I mean, I just cannot stop telling the truth. And I mean, telling the truth is good, but not when you're hurting people's feelings. And I'm worried I'm gonna ruin my dad's secret. Maybe the best thing for me to do right now is just go to sleep, go to bed. That's what I'm gonna do. Just go to bed. Oh my gosh, it's morning. I have to get thinking ready before my mom wakes up. Ah. This is horrible. My mom's gonna be coming in. Pinocchio, and I know exactly what you're going through because I too have a truth spell cast on me. Maybe I can help you. Cedarwood, I'm so glad you understand. Oh, I do hope you can help me with my issue, Cedarwood. What am I going to do to keep from telling my mom or dad surprise? I have a great idea, Kaylin. You can chew a huge piece of gum, and then your mom will understand what you're saying so you can't reveal your dad's secret. That's a great idea. Okay, now to go find a lot of gum. Kaylin, you ready to go to the picnic? <laughs> Why do you have so much gum in your mouth, silly? I can't understand a word you're saying. Okay, whatever, Kaylin. I don't know what you're up to, but come on, let's go have a picnic. Come on. I mean, Seriously, Kaylin, how are we gonna have a picnic if you've got this big, huge wad of gum in your mouth? I have no idea what you're saying. Maybe if you smell the flower again, the truth doll will be lifted. 
That's a great idea, Cedarwood. Let's give it a try. I think the truth bug bird left him. Yes, thank you so much, Cedarwood. Now let's go enjoy that picnic. Hey. Hi. Okay, Mom, let's eat. Oh, and here. I don't be needing that anymore. Oh, gee, thank you so much. Have you guys ever had trouble keeping a secret? If so, tell me about it in the comments below. So I'll see you guys next week. Toodles! Here are your shout outs.